Hello everyone, welcome to this video. We are going to be discussing Zon Guru, which is an up and coming Amazon FBA tool versus one of the big boys in the market, Jungle Scout. Tonight, we are going to witness the most anticipated match we are going to be putting these two tools head to head in this intense boxing match. You've got their health bars up here, and this is going to be a very, very, very to the point detailed video on which tool is better and which tool deserves your money. Let me just quickly add a, a slight disclaimer here. This is not going to be a tutorial on how to use the tools. If you're looking for those videos, then it will be in the description below. But this is literally just a breakdown of which tool I think, and again, it's all personal opinion, obviously, which tool I think is better after using both of them and testing both of them. Now, this is good if you're in the Amazon FBA business. If you're not in the Amazon FBA business, this is still a good video to watch because this is the start of your Amazon FBA journey. People always want to get a tool. They want to they want help product research, all that kind of stuff. So definitely watch this video just so you can get a bit of a better you know, if you get insight into if you want to start Amazon FBA, what tool should you be using? Right, before we get started with this video, and I like to get started straight away because I don't like to blag, I like to get to the point, pride myself on getting to the point, but before we get started, don't forget to smash that like button. I don't know what that punching was, it was, it's a bad form of punching, but don't forget to smash that like button, and actually the reason why I'm asking you to smash that like button is because, believe it or not, I have shot this entire video ready once this morning but my mic over here this bit wasn't connected very well and there was no audio just for that reason alone i think this video deserves a proper smash of the like button and watch the thing watch the video the whole way through because at the end i'll be giving a verdict and telling you which one is better in my mind so let's get started straight away we're going to be splitting this boxing match up into three different categories pricing pricing and features ease of use and accuracy, okay? And within each of those categories, we're gonna talk a bit about which tool is better, which tool is worse, and then we are going to give, well, we're going to give a score at the end of each category, and at the end, we will give an overall which one won. So let's get right into it. Round one, fight. Starting with pricing and features. Now I've got all my notes on my computer here because there was a lot and I wanted to make this detailed for you and accurate for you. So I didn't want to miss anything. So let's go through it right now. Both of the tools, let's start with the features. Both of the tools have very similar features. They both offer solid niche research tools, which I'm sure you're aware of. And that is basically where you you input all the categories that you're, you're happy to go for, you input the prices, you input the, the product rank, and then it will spit out a whole bunch of potentially good products. Both of the tools have brilliant versions of that tool, okay? Both of them have a solid product research tool where, but whereby, you know, on the Amazon actual website, you have the Chrome extension where you can click a button and it gives you all the information on that search that you have done on Amazon. Both have solid versions of that too. Both have very, very, very good tracking, tracking keywords, tracking products, tracking sales. They've both got tracking down to a T. Both track keywords and data in great detail. Okay, all the keyword data, they, they both have really good tracking, like brilliant for that. I think Zonguru have slightly better in terms of keyword tracking and finding out which keywords are better, but they both have pretty good. Right, Jungle Scout have pretty good business tools. You have a suite of business tools. And for example, once you've set up your product and you found a product and you're actually on Amazon, they have a pretty good, you know, range of different tools to help you further your success. So they've got, they've got setting up promotion, email automation, profit overviews, sales analytic, inventory tracking. So they've got all these really, really good tools. However, However, Zonguru take the lead here just slightly with their vast, vast suite of business tools. They have an incredible amount of business tools. And let's just go through them. And again, I have used all of these tools of both these pro products, both, both of these tools. Um, so this is all based off my personal opinion of what I preferred. And just to have a bit of a backstory, I've been selling on Amazon for over five years now, quite successfully, and we have quite a good large course and student base. So I feel like what I'm saying is somewhat validated from my experience. But again, you don't have to listen to anything I say. You can turn the video off now, but 
I ask that you don't, and let's finish on. Well, let's continue on. Song Guru take the lead with their vast suite of tools. They've got business features for once you set up. They've got overview of all the costs, the profit, the revenue, the sales, the business value, which is super cool because when you're coming to sell the business, it's nice to see how much you're worth. The inventory supply, email automator, which is a bit better than, than, than Jungle Scouts, and I'll explain a bit later. The review automator, which is super cool to help you get more reviews. The intellectual property monitor, which uh, I was like, this isn't necessary. You don't need this. It's already amazing, this tool, but why not throw it in? And then as well as that, they've got the individual order information, which is really cool because you can quickly jump to individual orders, the their page. It will take you to Amazon's page and you can see the order information. You can immediately contact the customer. You can blacklist a customer if they are causing you a lot of problems. So all of those tools together, I think that just kind of takes Zonguru slightly up. So you've got Zonguru here now and Jungle Scouts just below it over here. They both have, like I said before, a pretty good Chrome extension when you're actually on the amazon.com.co.uk, whatever dot you want to be on um, website. That way, when you search a keyword in Amazon's search bar, you can click their extension and it will pop up all the information. Zonguru's is slightly more detailed than Jungle Scouts, but we're going to get into more detail about ease of use and what was the last one? Accuracy um, a bit later on in the video. So again, keep watching because that's the most important stuff. Accuracy, which is the last round, you should say, I should say, is um, the most important part of any tools, you know, backbone. Right, continue on. Um, Zonguru have a few extra features worth mentioning because, I mean, this is going through features. So this is features that I didn't see on Jungle Scout. They have a love-hate feature, which basically scans everyone's listings and it tells you all that, it spits out all the negative reviews and all the positive reviews, which is really good when you're doing product research because you can find out what all the negative reviews are and all the bad parts of people's products were. And then when you're going to design that product or order that product from China, you can make sure that you offer better solutions for those, you know, mishaps that the other people have done. So that's really, really cool. They've also got a pretty good listing optimizer, which is very, very good in terms of creating your product listing. So that helps you with keywords, with other people's backend keywords to see what everyone's doing. So that's pretty good. Both have a new feature which actually helps you find suppliers, which I think is brilliant. Um, it actually allows you to, you know, conduct product um, um, supplier research on the tool and it's linked to Alibaba, which I think is really, really good. And both have pretty decent training and education when it comes to Amazon FBA and using their tool. So both of those are kind of the same. Lastly, the price, the price of round one. This is the big crux of, of all of, of, of this round, really. This is going to be what takes it away. Jungle Scout starts at $69 a month. However, and this is a big however, and this is what's going to lose them the round, spoiler alert, it's $69 a month all the way up to $419 a month. And it's based on the number of sales you are getting. So as a newbie, if you're not selling on Amazon yet, then you will be looking at paying $69 a month. However, someone like me who's looking to invest in a tool, right? Or as soon as you get started on Amazon, you start getting sales. The tool changes price at 500 increments. I think, let me have a quick check. I don't want to make a mistake here. The tool changes price quite drastically. <clears throat> and you can see from the picture that I have put up, it starts at $69 a month, but it jumps up to $89 if you've got 501 to 2,000 orders. It jumps up to $119 if you've got 2,001 to 5,000 orders. And it goes all the way to $419 a month if you've got 10,000 plus orders. And in my mind, why the hell are you charging more money if I'm getting more orders? Yes, I know I'm making more money, but that does not mean you should be charging me more money just because someone has more money it doesn't mean they should spend it they could be very good with their money and realize actually i don't want to spend this extra money so i don't like that at all that they're charging all this extra i can understand if they're charging a bit extra because of the extra you know information they have to keep in their tool but charging up to 419 dollars is a bit drastic for me with zonguru you have the 49 dollar plan which doesn't really cover as much stuff and it doesn't tick all the boxes so the business plan which is at 99 dollars a month is what 
I would go for. And $99 a month, I know is more than Jungle Scout's original $69 a month, but that's $99 a month for everything. You're not paying $99 a month between $99 and $419. It's just $99 a month, okay? They also have another version, which is $199 a month, which has a few more features and um, bigger numbers of the existing features from the $99 a month one. But again, not necessary to go for. You'll be absolutely fine with the $99 a month. So what is the verdict of round one? Round one, both are excellent because of Jungle Scout's erratic pricing and that I absolutely hate. I'm going to give round one to Zon Guru. So the small company is coming its way up. So for me, I just can't see why Jungle Scout should charge up to $419 a month. I don't know if they have anyone in that tier. I'm sure they've got lots of people and it's a bit of a slap in the face. So round one goes to Zon Guru. Well done. Let's begin round two. Round two, fight. This is the ease of use round. Okay, so customer service pretty seems to be pretty good on both fronts. In terms of who has better customer service, um, I feel that Zonguru will have slightly better customer service. And by the way, this isn't a sponsored video of either. The links to both of the tools are in the description down below and I am an affiliate of both tools. So whichever one you select, it, it doesn't make a difference to my life. I've, I've got no individual affiliation with either of the tools. Okay, so I don't want this to seem like it's biased. But anyway, back to customer service. Now, my point that I'm about to make makes a lot of sense. Because Zonguru is a smaller company, <clears throat> they want to try harder and make sure that they build a relationship with their customers and they've got less customers. So they actually have more time to work on their customers that they do have. So because Jungle Scout is a much, much bigger corporation, it's a bit more faceless and you're dealing with a lot more customer support teams. So in that sense, I'm going to say Zongu just takes the customer service portion of this round. Now, in terms of the rest of the different tools that they offer, like the Chrome extension or the tools within their actual suite, I'm going to say Jungle Scout is actually slightly easier to use off the bat. Okay, so what I mean by that is when you're first using the tools, when you're first trying them, Jungle Scout will jump to you a bit better. It's um, the immediate ease, ease of use for Jungle Scout is a lot better. Zongu is slightly more complicated. However, and this is a big, big however, once you realize how to use Zonguru, and it will take you a few times, you might have to watch a few of the training videos, but once you realize how to use it, it will become really easy to use. And they, the, the, what they offer is slightly more detailed which, which is why it's more complicated. So Zonguru is kind of like an iPhone. It's very simple to use, very basic. Sorry, Jungle Scout is like an iPhone. It's very simple to use, very basic. Okay, it's brilliant and it's incredible, but it's, it's basic, right? And, uh, and that's why people get it straight away. And that's why people love it. Zonguru is like Android. It can be a bit to figure out at times and you've got to actually learn how to use it. But once you can use it, what you can do with it is astronomical, right? You can do so many different things with the tool and it's just, there's so many features. Okay. So in terms of that, I'm going to give the win to Jungle Scout just because this round is all about ease of use and ease of use off the bat is very, very important. So I'm going to say that Jungle Scout is the winner of round two. But I don't want you to disregard that Zonguru, once you get used to it, will become a super powerhouse in your suite of tools. And that brings us on to round three. Final round, fight. Accuracy of information. So which tool is actually spitting out the most accurate information in terms of profit numbers, keyword data, products, uh, supplier, validity, all of this kind of stuff, okay? So this is the most important part of any tool's well, validity or, or, or reason for being, okay? If a tool doesn't have good accuracy, it doesn't matter how many features they're offering, it doesn't matter how easy it is to use, it's going to be a waste of your time and a waste of your money. You need a tool that is good and has good accuracy. So the way I test the accuracy, and this is the only way I can kind of think of testing the accuracy to make it a fair game, is to input my own products into the tool, okay? And that way I can test what the tool's information is giving me on my product, and I can actually go into the back end of my Amazon Seller Central, which is 
the analytics from Amazon's own data so as accurate as it can be, right? And I compared the two datas. That is how I decided which tool was more accurate. So based on my tests, Zon Guru does come out of it being slightly more accurate than Jungle Scout. I don't know how they do it. I don't know what algorithms they're using. I don't know how they're tapping into Amazon's numbers, but based on the profit, the pricing, the the estimated sales, the estimated revenue, all of those numbers, Zon Guru take the win just slightly. Now, based off of that, because in terms of, of keywords, you can't really track which product, which tool has better keyword uh, um, data, which is more reliable. However, based on the numbers of Zonguru winning just a bit, I like to think and I like to say that Zonguru's keyword research, the data that they give off the keyword, how many searches it gets, how many people are using it, the optimization of all of that, I'm going to say that they win slightly off of the keywords as well. So Jungle Scout is good, but in terms of accuracy of the numbers and everything, Zonguru slightly take the win. And for me, you can't really put a price on accuracy. In terms of, let's say Zonguru was 10 times the price, but it was 10 times the accuracy, I would say go for Zonguru. So because Zonguru is slightly more accurate, for me, that's the most important important element of this entire boxing match this entire showdown of these two tools which is why i saved it for round three so i think zonguru are going to take round three with a slight knockout all right zonguru have taken this boxing match and have won this incredible showdown this small company this smaller smaller company and the big boy company they have slowly knocked them out and come on top okay they have won the the heavyweight i've got to stop with this boxing terminology i i don't know boxing well enough and i sound stupid so let me just do a quick roundup okay round one went to zonguru for the price and just a few extra features round two went to jungle scout for the ease of use so if you are someone who doesn't really know how to use a computer and it just wants something as easy to use as wildly possible then jungle scout did take round two on ease of use and in terms of accuracy when you're looking to be incredibly precise with your research and you want to really narrow the gap in terms of finding a successful product if you want to make sure you find a successful product you need your numbers to be as accurate as possible and zonguru took around three in terms of accuracy so that is the end of this incredible showdown if you liked this video and you want to see more showdowns like this video leave a comment down below of tools that you want me to compare with each other i can do helium 10 i can do Oh, there's a whole bunch. There's AMZ Tracker. There's this Unicorn Smasher tool, which is all part of it. There's a whole bunch of them. But, and I want to ask you, which tool is your favorite if you're selling on Amazon? And if you are not selling on Amazon, if you're doing print on demand or anything else, which tool would you get? Which tool sounds better? And again, don't forget if you use any of these tools or you don't use any of these tools, doesn't make a difference. Give this video a thumbs up, smash the like button. It makes a massive difference to me and I really appreciate it. And I just wanna end this video by just saying a quick thank you very much to everyone who is commenting smashing that like button and who is subscribed to my channel you guys are literally the bread and butter of this youtube channel and you're the reason i'm still making videos as often as i possibly can so i just want to say a massive thank you and i will see you in the next video